In a beautiful countryside, there lived three good friends, Benny the Bunny, Ollie the Owl, and Nibbles the Chipmunk. Bunny, being the fastest animal in the neighborhood, was always bragging about his speed. He would boast, no one can beat me in a race. One afternoon, as Benny once again showed off his speed, Ollie, who was quiet but wise, said, speed isn't everything, Benny. Sometimes slow and steady wins the race. Benny burst out laughing, you beat me in a race? That's impossible, Ollie. You're so slow you'll never make it to the finish line. Nibbles, who had been watching nearby, hopped down and said, how about we settle this once and for all? Let's have a race, and I'll be the judge. Both Benny and Ollie agreed, and they set the finish line. Nibbles clapped his tiny paws and announced, the race will start tomorrow morning. I'll be at the finish line to make sure it's fair. The next day, Ollie stood calmly at the starting line while Benny stretched and prepared, confident in his victory. Nibbles climbed onto a branch and held a leaf high in the air. On your marks, get set, go. Nibbles squeaked, dropping the leaf. Benny shot off like an arrow, racing far ahead and disappearing down the path. Ollie, on the other hand, began his slow and steady walk, step by step. Ollie wasn't worried at all he knew he couldn't compete with Benny's speed, but he trusted his own pace. As Benny raced ahead, he looked back and saw no one on the path. This is too easy. He laughed, I've got plenty of time. Ollie's so slow, I could sleep for hours and still win. He hopped over to a soft patch of grass. I think I'll take a nap. Benny said to himself and went to sleep. Meanwhile, Ollie kept moving, slow and steady, without stopping. He didn't rush, but he didn't rest either. He just kept going, passing the spot where Benny was sleeping. His legs were tired. But he simply moved forward, step by step, with his eyes fixed on the finish line. Hours later, Benny woke up, stretched, and yawned. When he looked down the path, he saw no one. Laughing, he raced off at full speed, but it was too late. Just as Benny reached the finish line, he saw Ollie standing there, smiling. Benny was stunned. How did you beat me? He asked, still trying to catch his breath. Ollie smiled warmly. I told you. Benny slow and steady wins the race. Nibbles, who had climbed down to congratulate the winner, nodded. Benny, you were too focused on your speed and didn't take the race seriously. But Ollie kept going, he never gave up. And that's why he won. Benny hung his head, feeling a bit embarrassed. I guess I was too overconfident. I should have taken the race seriously. Ollie placed a friendly wing on Benny's shoulder and said, It's okay, Benny. We all learn from our mistakes. From that day on. Benny became more humble. He no longer bragged about his speed and came to admire Ollie's patience and perseverance. So friends, it's not about how fast you go, but how you keep going.